We're at World of Beer right now with Patrick. Patrick's the GM. Great to see you today. Hey Tim, thanks Tell for Tell us your in. story about World of Beer. Um, we've been open since 2014. We have 50 parking spaces right down the street around the corner. Um, R for retail spaces. Uh, we're right in the center of the downtown mall and the university over here. We serve one of the, I think we have one of the most taps in town, 58. Mm -hmm. uh, we also do cocktails, uh, we do wine, um, have somewhere around like 450 bottles. Live music on the weekends, Fridays and Saturdays, usually starts around 8. We also serve brunch on Saturdays and Sundays. Um, trivia on Tuesdays starts at 7. Uh, it's a lot of fun. Great, now let's take a look at some of these uh, flights you've got prepared for us. Sure, absolutely, Tim. Uh, the first one we have is an introduction to hops. Uh, we go from a Pilsner, a Pale Ale, an IPA, and then a double IPA. Uh, first one is Firestone Walker, based out of California. Uh, it's a hopped Pilsner. So smooth, crisp on the backbone with a little bit of hops added to it. Next up, we have Heavy Seas out of Baltimore. It's called the Americana. Mm -hmm. um, it's going to increase a little bit on the hop profile, but the hops they use are going to be way more tropical. After that, we're going to go to Foothills out of North Carolina. Mm -hmm. um, it's part of their Craft Happiness series. It's called the Safe. Um, basically, every month they release a new IPA, and it's, uh, the proceeds go to charity. Uh, this nice. month, it's for nice. teachers. Okay. Um, last but not least, we're going to go to a double IPA. Uh, this is Stone, originally out of California, now out of Richmond, so you could argue it's local. It's part of the Enjoy By series. Uh, it's the Stone Independence Day, mm -hmm. or the uh, 7 4 18, but 9.4% in alcohol, it's a lot more hot backbone to it, but just yeah. super fresh and almost dry towards the end. Um, and now the newest rage right now is sours. Right. Um, we try to keep uh, at least five or six sour lines at all times, uh, try to keep super broad things on the, on the tap wall. Um, first up is Pale Fire out of Harrisonburg. It's called Ocean Song. It's basically a gozo. Um, refreshing, a little tart, subtly salty towards the end. Um, next up is Victory. Um, this is the Cherry Kirsch Goza. So you're going to have kind of like a similar aspect to that, but you need more cherry for it. Right. Are we moving more in the sour direction with each one we try here? Yeah. yeah, yeah um, okay. More fruity, more puckery. You know, it's kind of like your baseline and you're just going like increasing mm. in flavor profile. Really interesting uh, nose on that too. Oh yeah. It's, you know, it's like... It's really good that one. I like that. All right, cool. what have we got here? Uh, so super local to Charlottesville. Uh, it's three notch. It's their passion fruit goza. Okay. Just super passion fruit forward. This one's probably like less salty towards the end, but super refreshing. Uh, last but not least, this is Uzelfinch. Okay. Um, they're based out of uh, near like Hampton, kind of Norfolk area. Mm -hmm. uh, it's called the Dr. Rendezvous. Um, okay. It's an American wild style. Um, way more sour aspect to it. Okay. Yeah, definitely. Very notable. Some people just love that pucker. Yeah, it's got a really distinct character to it. Well, those were some really, really good selections there that you pulled for us today. It really gives cool. you a good, a good understanding of some of the uh, variety you've got on tap here. Yeah, um, we always do different kinds of flights, like seasonally. Mm. Um, you know, fall flights, summer flights, spring flights. Mm. We'll do free flights. Um, basically, people can make their own as well. Right. Um, we're not too picky about it, just want people to enjoy it. <laughs> okay, um, terrific. There's a lot to try. Right. So Tim, this is the Pilsner Quell. It's the first Pilsner in the world. Uh, we do something kind of special here. Uh, we have the European tap handle. Basically, we uh, create a layer of film on the bottom, and then we push the beer up, and kind of like put on full throttle. And uh, basically, oxygen uh, doesn't touch the beer underneath, which changes the taste profile. Got it's it. way more crisp, way more smooth, it's not metallic-y, it's delicious. All right, let's try it. Yeah. Really, really smooth, isn't it? It's yeah. light, it's, it's foamy, it's uh, creamy. Mm -hmm. It's got a really nice texture to it, very drinkable. First up, we have probably one of my favorite burgers in the world. We have the Chimay Burger. All our burgers are half pound patties. Uh, basically, it's caramelized onions, sauteed mushrooms, and we make a house-made Chimayo, uh, which is we actually take Chimay from the draw each day and make an aioli, smother it on there, and then we get a giant slab of Chimay cheese, which we import from Belgium. Uh, taste profile is somewhere between like a Munster and a Swiss, and we just melt it on the flat top and just smear it on top. It's great. Uh, if you pair it with a Belgian triple, it goes amazing. And of course, the fresh tots on the side. Um, next up is our classic cheeseburger. You know, just cheddar, bacon, fresh lettuce, tomato, and sweet potato fries. Um, next is our Wob Cob. Uh, it's spring greens drizzled with Greek dressing, mozzarella cheese, corn, chicken, cherry tomatoes, avocado, drizzled, and barbecue sauce. 
super delish. Next up, we have the Cali Bowl. Um, basically, just a rice bowl um, with veggies, uh, cherry tomatoes, carrots, um, blackened steak, avocado, and scallions with a little sesame seed oil. And probably a prized possession, our German pretzel. Things larger than my head. We make a house deli mustard, somewhere between like a Dijon and honey hybrid. And then we make beer cheese daily, uh, fresh from the drop. Um, just smothered with spices and cheese and all the good stuff you could ever want. We've had a great time at World of Beer today. Thanks for taking great care of us, Patrick. Yes, Sam. We'll Anytime. come back again soon. Cool. Bye. Nice stop, bye.